Hi guys, welcome back to another Rorschach Pictures. Today I'm going to show you how I solved a light leak problem. Now, I was looking for a cheap matte box solution and I ended up with these plastic ones from eBay. Problem with these things is you can't add filters. So I followed the instructions from a YouTuber by the name or the YouTube channel by Chun Da. I'll leave links in the description below where he shows how to convert one of these into a filter holding matte box. This is using those uh, those cheap square filters that you can buy off of eBay. The entire he's got an entire part list that you can do this conversion with. What makes this nice is it rotates and you can add yourself your filters in the back there and so on and so forth. But there's a problem with this setup. Because of these huge gaps, you get light leak. So what light leak is when you're panning or hit heavy sunlight at the right angle, light actually gets into these gaps, which ruins your shot. So now that is something that you need to solve. So basically what I'm saying is this matte box needs knickers. Yep. You heard me right, and I'm talking about nun's knickers. Now, what a nun's knicker is, is a, a cylinder of material that would go over here and over your lens and cut that extra light leak out. And I went and I decided to make myself one because, well, two things, I'm cheapskate and I'm broke. So what I decided to do, I went and found myself something that was shipped in one of these sort of like canvas bags. Now, you can find many products that are packaged in these, anything from Sennheiser headphones to this is a car charger to motorcycle helmets. Right, so now that we're looking down at my table, these, this is the setup that the Max Bo Macbox has. And as you can see, you get light leak in those gaps which sucks balls. So I've gone halfway with this. Then I decided to make a YouTube video on how I did it. Fairly simple, I just put a piece of elastic where the string goes through, cut off the ass end over here, singe the edges, turn this over, got my mom-in-law to stitch a seam in there. And well, you're joining me for the last step and that is to literally just take a piece of elastic. Okay piece of elastic over there, putting a safety pin through it and just feeding that boy through there. Right, and whack, there we go. So now what we have is this. We have a bagger with a rack here or an elastic band. South Africa would call a racky through it. And we'll go snip over there, and that's that. Now, because your lenses are smaller than your uh, your matte box, you don't want to pull this one too tight. The simple reason is so that it can actually fit over the matte box without crushing anything. Tie your first notch. Oh, come on, fingers, just do what I want you to do. Tie a knot. So what I suggest we do, we grab our matte box over here, and we see if this boy fits over. Nice and snug. And there you go. You have your nun's knickers over your matte box. Pull in, go over your lens, like that. Just a quick tip, make sure that it's nothing is in view of the lens, like it's not crinkling up on your lens. And there you go. Nun's knickers over your lens. So guys, that is how you make yourself a cheap pair of knickers. Nun's knickers for your cheap matte box with a chin da update. Only downside to this actual thing is if you're using the Nikon still lenses, it is your focus ring gets in the way or the knickers get in the way of your focus ring, so you'll have to get your focus first. But other than that, it will clean the light from your videos. On that note, I'm going to think I'm going to call it a video, so please like, subscribe, thumbs up, thumbs down. Thumbs up helps a lot. Share this video, that helps a lot as well. If you like what you see, click that bell icon because you, as you know, if you click the bell icon, you'll get notified when we're uploading more videos. And there are gonna be a few more videos. If you like this, hang around. I'm not saying that we're gonna be doing old DIY videos because we're gonna be doing short movies and we're also gonna be doing some tutorial videos in the future. On that note, I'm saying, 
I'm out of here. Cheers.